Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. Today we discuss successive approximation type analog to digital converter. In analog to digital converter there are so many types, but successive approximation type is widely used because it takes lesser time compared with other methods. In this approximation method, this is the diagram. We have chosen the component comparator, control logic, output register and DAC. Here comparator compares with a fixed input voltage that is analog. Here we have chosen 10.7 volt with the output of DAC, digital to analog converter. Now, two outputs will be provided if analog input is high, analog input is high means analog input is applied in non-inverting terminal. If analog input is more or high, then the comparator output is high. If high, then it will retain the earlier value of the control output register. And if DAC is more than analog input, then output of comparator will be low and it will reset the output register particular bit. Here output register is 4 bit means 0, 0, 0, 0 to 0, 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1, 1. This is the range. So, 0, 0, 0, 0 means 0, 0, 0, 0 means 0 volt and 1, 1, 1, 1 means 15 volt. This is the range. Now, the output register initially 0, 0, 0, 0 and it will be loaded after providing the clock pulse one bit at a time and it will start from MSB. So, initially it is a 0, 0, 0, 0 then clock pulse is applied, then output register value is first is start from MSB. So, this value is 1 and other bits are remain same. Now, 1 0 0 0 means 8 volt, 0 0 0 0 means 0 volt, 0 0 0 1 means 1 volt, 0 0 1 0 means 2 volt, 0 0 1 1 means 3 volt, 0 1 0 0 4 volt, 0 1 0 1 5 volt, 0 1 1 0 6 volt, 0 1 1 1 7 volt, 1 0 0 0 8 volt. In this way 1 0 0 0 is 8 volt. Now this value is converted, this is digital binary that, that is converted to analog value by DAC and this 8 volt appears here at inverting terminal of the op amp. Now comparator, comparator compares these two value 10.7 and 8 volt and finds 10.7 is higher. It is applied non-inverting terminal and the output of comparator is high. Due to this high output control logic sets the bit we have changed earlier is retained that means for next time that bit is retained and after giving another clock pulse the next bit is changed. So, it is 1100. Zero, zero. Now, 1100 zero, zero means 12 volt it is converted by DAC and applied to the comparator. So, 10.7 and 12 volt is compared and found DAC output is high that is applied in inverting terminal, comparator provides the low output. Low output provides the comparator means control logic cleared that output or reset the output. That means now it is 1 0 and third bit after giving clock pulse third bit is set and fourth bit is as usual remain same as usual. So, 1 0 1 0 means 10 volt. Now, this 10 volt is applied in comparator 10.7 and 10. 
now analog input is high so output of the comparator is high control logic retain that bit and fourth bit is set so 1011 means 11 volt once again it is compared and found the comparator output is low because DAC is high and it is applied in budding terminal so output is low so when it is low then control logic resets or clear that particular bit so found that 1010 and all the bits all the four bits is applied and then that EOC signal is activated and it provides that is a signal to the output that is the counting process is completed and the desired value is 10 volt. So, 10.7 volt that analog value is approximated with the corresponding digital value is 1010 that means 10 volt that is why this uh, method is named as approximation successive approximation type and we have uh, obtained the 10.7 volt digital value that is 1010. Thank you.